In South Africa, amputee care is a service most cannot afford. Prosthetics can cost anything from 200 US dollars to 100 US dollars. This is Bongile, founder of Ukuamba Prosthetics, a small business that uses 3D technology to produce low-cost prosthetic limbs out of recycled materials such as water bottles. She says her gum infection four years ago led her to starting the business. Like I just um, had a gum infection, so from my local clinic, they actually referred me to my local hospital. And then from there, I actually witnessed, you know, and I, I saw, you know, how our people are actually struggling to access prosthetics. And then on the very same day, like, I actually engaged and tried to put myself in an empty tissue, you know, where an empty was not able to access the prosthetic limbs. But to me, it was like, yesterday it might not be me, but what if it could be me, you know, or one of my loved ones, you know, because we all don't know what the future holds. And I literally tapped in and actually asked, what's the problem? And the user told me, like, an MPT that hey, he's been on the waiting list for more than five years. Whilst Mongile has dreams of increasing production of prosthetics, from her small facility, activity has been impacted by South Africa's energy crisis. We actually encountered load shedding. It actually, you know, um, delayed our turnaround time because sometimes when a user actually comes, we are actually able to say that within eight hours or eight hours, you will be able, you know, to produce your prosthetic. Michael Stevens from Jumping Kids, an organization that supplies and maintains quality prosthetic equipment for children, believes that while the old way of manufacturing technology has worked, the future is towards prosthetics that have high-tech features such as gyroscopes. Then, then the, the previous solutions that have been used for the last 30 years, uh, mechanical solutions, should be coming down in cost. And we should be looking at the issue. Uh, I think prosthetics and amputation is often looked at by people as a niche issue. Innovative 3D printed robotic prosthetic limbs can provide African amputees with an affordable and high quality alternative in comparison to conventional prosthesis. Wandi Swandeng into Johannesburg, South Africa, Africa News.